Hello, in this video we are going to see one simple aspect that is basically how to display the error pages and access denied pages. What basically happens is like when you are in Drupal and you try to access some page which does not exist, it will show you this message. And similarly I have opened one in private window because if I am logged in as admin, I am not going to get any kind of access denied. But here I am trying to access admin area without being logged in. So it says access denied. Now these two pages look very blank and very simple. So Drupal allows us to basically change this by going to configuration system basic site settings. This is where you can set the site name, slogan, email address and the front page which is set to welcome. And here we can set the pages, but these pages should be created first. So let's go to content. Let's add some content. So over here, this error message is because there is an update available for a Drupal, which I will do later on. So instead of basic page, I would prefer to take article because it allows me to have a image added to it. So let's say this is page not found and here we will select our image of alert okay this image is set and here you can give some message in some heading style let us say sorry in the page you are looking for does not AXIST exist does not exist and to be adding a bit more fun least till now okay so some tags and all can be added to article but we will just leave it like this let's set the URL alias actually we don't need a URL alias for this but still we will keep it as slash page not found okay page not found this is the URL alias not promoted we don't want it promoted anywhere and let's save this page okay it says you have to fill out alternative text so here let us say alert icon fine so I have added this text now let's save this page and page not found and this icon is showing up directly over here interestingly article allows to provide some comments over here so let's edit this again and simply disable the comment settings we don't want any comments for this and let us save this now this page is saved icon is showing up and sorry your page does not exist similarly let me add uh, another page for our access denied let's add an article again let's go for a double c e double s access d e denied access denied here again let's add the other one let's put the warning logo with this and let's go for thing h2 you are not allowed to access this area leave leave now okay some message again here we will put the URL alias as a double c is this access and I de denied access denied I have put up as my this thing again we don't want this promoted and let's save this again okay again I forgot to do this so here warning icon and let's save this so now we have our access denied page ready and our other page ready for a second I was like 
why am i getting access in it <laughs> okay so now these two pages are ready let's go back to this point and here 403 we will have access slash d e n i e d the path which you had given and here page not found and let's save this configuration fine so if it has accepted it that means this is correct it updates it to the actual node number node value because you might decide to change the page name or paths so here it is updated to the node value okay now let's try for page not found let's try for this and what happens now is you see this page not found okay and in the other one access denied let's try this and here we are getting this access denied this is, so later on when we learn more about different content types and all we can create a nicer page but this was the basic information that i wanted to provide in this video